Amelia Clark, also known as Daenerys Targaryen, arguably the most known character from the TV show Game of Thrones. Now, Game of Thrones also has a bunch of card sets, 15 different sets to be exact. Today, I'm going to be explaining every single Daenerys Targaryen auto you could possibly pack. Let's get into it. Before I get into the specifics of how many different autos there are, the thing that Rittenhouse does that I like is that they have different tiers of, of autographs on how rare they are. So you have normal, which is over 500. You have limited, which is between 300 and 500. You have very limited, which is 200 to 300. Extremely limited, which is 100 to 200. Or you have scarce. This is 100 or less. So it kind of gives you an idea on... How, how many autos were printed or how rare a certain auto is. But yeah, so we have that to go off of. Now, I'm going to go in order from beginning season one to the, the very last set, the most recent set that was released, Art and Images. So yeah, season one has her very first Game of Thrones autograph ever to be printed and put out to be packed. This, again, well, I didn't say this, but I'm going to try and throw up pictures on the screen or along with comps from eBay to kind of give you an idea of how, how much this card sold for or, you know, what it looks like. So, yeah, season one, she has a bordered autograph, which is in the tier limited, lower on the lower end of the limited spectrum. So limited is three between 300 and 500. I'd probably say there's maybe 350 of these autographs. So pretty good amount, but I know that there were 9,500 boxes made for season one so you kind of kind of do the math there on how many boxes you would need to buy to statistically pack one but yeah you got a bordered for season one now season two for, for me i believe that this is probably the most known autograph that she has for game of thrones if you go on ebay right now and look up daenerys targaryen game of thrones autograph and put the search filter to highest price most of those autographs you're going to see a season two full bleed auto this is this is arguably the most popular autograph she has and the most known one that you see considering that there are it is in the very limited tier which is between 200 and 300 copies so yeah it's a crazy expensive card probably arguably my biggest chase card for my game of thrones collection so yeah that's for season two now she doesn't have an autograph until Iron Anniversary Series 1, which is a lot later, considering she has one in Season 1, one in Season 2, and then all the way to Iron Anniversary Series 1. Now, she doesn't have just a full bleed auto or bordered autograph or any base auto. She actually has a set of inscription autos. And one thing that Rittenhouse does with Game of Thrones, they might do it for other sets, is that they have inscription autos, which have, say you have... I'm just going to go into over it. So you have Amelia Clark, and then there's a bunch of different inscriptions that you could possibly pack. She has eight different inscriptions that you could pack, and all of them are between five and ten copies. So there are very, very limited in the print run for Daenerys Targaryen inscription autos. So just go over all the different inscriptions that you could possibly pack. And again, these are all five to ten copies made. That's insane. So you have Daenerys Storborn, you have Khaleesi, Daenerys Targaryen, Dracarys, Mother of Dragons, Breaker of Chains, Break the Wheel, and I Will Rule. All of those you could possibly pack between five and ten copies. Again, I'll try and throw up pictures on the screen. I'm assuming that a lot of these cards just don't surface often just because there's a bunch of boxes that haven't even been opened again, and they're just... It's Daenerys Targaryen. Everybody wants a Game of Thrones Daenerys Targaryen auto. If you collect Game of Thrones, that's your chase card. So, yeah, she's got those. And then also in Iron Anniversary Series 2, she has Relic Quote cards, which are all listed as scarce. Again, scarce is 100 copies or less. I'd assume that these are probably in the single-digit print run. I, I, don't, I, I don't believe that a lot of these cards even exist, to be honest with you just because of you know the qual the 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 tier that Daenerys Targaryen is she's in tier one it's just who you want so she also has eight different 
different relic quote cards that you could possibly pack. Just go over the quote real quick. So you have, I am Daenerys Storborn of House Targaryen. You have, I'm no ordinary woman. All men must die, but we are not men. I will take what I, is mine with fire and blood. The Iron Throne is mine and I will take it. I will do what queens do. I will rule. Fire cannot kill a dragon. I will answer injustice with justice. Those are all listed as scarce. Like I said, I, I, I don't even think I've ever seen one in, in person ever at any show. And if I go check on eBay, I'd assume that not a lot of these are even on there. So I'll try and throw up pictures of what I can find. But yeah, that's it for Iron Anniversary Series 2. Or Series 1, sorry. And then you have Iron Anniversary Series 2, where she has four different autographs. She has a full bleed autograph, which is between 10 and 25 copies in the scarce. These are all in the scarce category, but they actually gave numbers. If you go to rittenhousecards.com and look at the checklist, they actually give numbers for her, just because she's the best auto you could possibly pack. So you got the full bleed auto, which is between 10 and 25 copies. You have the gold, the, the, the black, black card with gold ink. That is between 10 and 25 copies as well. And for the Valerian Steel autograph card, she also has between 10 and 25 copies. But for the bordered autograph, there's only five and 10, only between five and 10 copies made, which is insane. So if you kind of do, if you do the, even if you do the maximum amount of what they recommend, there's only 85 different autographs from Daenerys Targaryen in Iron Anniversary Series 2, which is not a lot. I'd assume that the print runs probably close to 10,000. So if you only have 80, you know, 80 different autographs, you're just, it's, it's going to take you forever to, you need to be really lucky to pack one of these. You know what I mean? So that's it for Iron Anniversary Series 2. Then we move on to the complete Series 2, where she has probably, arguably her most I don't know. I don't know. I'll let you know. I'll, you guys decide on what your most, what the most popular Daenerys Targaryen auto is. But to start off, you have another full bleed auto, which is limit, listed in the scarce. Again, probably on the lower end, maybe between 10 and 25, like the other ones. Don't believe there's many of these out there. But this is the first dual autograph that she has signed for that is in this box you have the Daenerys Targaryen Jon Snow dual autograph on card hand numbered to 50 which is insane that would that that's also one of the biggest chase cards I have the hand numbered to 50 dual autograph Daenerys Targaryen Jon Snow yeah I don't even know if there's any sales on eBay I'll see if I can throw some up or what I can find but yeah that's that's a crazy chase card I mean if you have that I wish, I wish. And last but, not, last but not least, we have the Art and Images set. This is also a, another set where she has another dual autograph with hand numbering. But to start off, you got the, the, she only has two autographs in the set. You have the Legacy autograph, which is listed in the Scarce. This is a new, this is a new type of autograph only found in Art and Images. So that's cool. But she also has the Daenerys Targaryen, Dario Naharis dual autograph these are also hand numbered but they're only to 33 so less than her other dual autograph which is insane i like how it's hand number two it's kind of kind of gives it more of a i don't know i don't know a hand number is just different than on i don't know let me know what you guys think do you guys prefer the hand numbering or the actual numbering i i prefer hand numbering i just think it's it's uh it's definitely unique and before I finished editing this video, I actually realized I missed two different autographs from Daenerys Targaryen. I don't know how, but I'm glad I was able to catch it before I finished editing this video, so I technically shouldn't have missed any now, but I missed two different ones, and both of them are relic cut autographs. I guess that's how I missed them, but yes. Yeah, so the first one I missed was from Inflections. Throw it up on the screen. I couldn't find many of them on eBay, to be honest with you. I believe there's only one or two of them up on eBay as of now. But yeah, it's a relic cut auto. It's a piece of her clothing that they shown in the photo. I'd assume so. But yeah, the, the there's I can assume that there's less than 10 copies of these in the world. It's listed as scarce, but which means 100 or less. There's no way there's, there's close to 100 of these in the world. 
I'd assume there's less than 10, like I said. But yeah, if you have one of these, dude, I wish. I wish I had one of those. But yeah, that's her first relic cut order that I missed. And the second one I missed was actually from the Complete series. And now, this is also another Relic Cut Auto with a piece of her, I believe it's cape. It's kind of got some purple tint in there, so I'd assume it's from the cape. But yeah, on Rittenhouse website, there's technically no numbering. It doesn't say scarce or anything next to it. But again, I'm going to assume that it's less than 10 copies in the world because there's only one up on eBay. I just checked. I believe there's only one up on eBay as of now, and it's for thousands of dollars. So yeah assume that there's less than 10 copies but technically it doesn't say so you could say whatever you want but yeah those are the two i missed thankfully was able to get them in this video that's all of the Daenerys Targaryen autos let me know what you guys think of this video if you want me to do another one i could do another one for a different character i could do it for a different show let me know hopefully this this helped you in learning something about game of thrones if you are going to open up boxes now you know which boxes have Daenerys Targaryen autos. So, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned to the next video. Bye.